Hey there y'all, welcome to my channel, Elasting Beauty. So today I am going to show you how to become beautiful. And what better way to do this than to do a makeup tutorial. So I'm going to go ahead and get right on into this. I've never tried to do my makeup on my bed, so we're going to see how this goes because I don't really have a big mirror. So I'm just going to be using um, the mirror and my makeup products. So we'll see how this goes. You're going to start with putting a moisturizer all over your face. And I am applying my foundation and then blending it out with a beauty blender. And we're just going to speed this up a little bit. Then I'm going in with two different types of concealer. One to kind of contrast the green underneath my eye and then the other just to brighten it. And then I'm gonna dab around my eye and then again I'm gonna blend using my Beauty Blender. Then I'm going to set my foundation and my concealer with my powder all over my face. Then to add some warmth to my nice fair skin, I'm going to add a little bit of a bronzer underneath my cheekbones and then on my forehead. And then going in with a rosy blush, I'm just starting at the apples of my cheeks and blending outwards. And then I am applying a highlight on top of my cheekbones on top of my nose, my forehead, my cupid's bow, and my chin. Then I'm gonna go in with a light shimmery pink color all over my lid and using a light brown on my crease. Then I will blend it out and blend more and blend and I keep blending for a little while. Next, I'm going to line my eyes using a liquid eyeliner. And I start at the outer corner with the wing and I go towards the inner corner. And I'll just do the best that I can to do the exact same thing on both eyes. And then to finish off the eyes, I am applying a couple coats of mascara to the top and bottom lashes. And to complete the whole look, I am adding a bright pinky red lip color. Untying my hair. My hair is already done, so yeah. And there is the finished look. Here's the deal. I used to think that makeup is what made me look beautiful. The truth is though, no matter how much more I thought I was beautiful with my makeup, it starts to get old. You start to realize that maybe that isn't what real beauty actually is. Maybe there's more to beauty than just the physical. Even when I put makeup on my face, I still can look in the mirror and point out multiple flaws that I see on my face. Why do I have smile lines? Why do I have bags under my eyes? Flaws, flaws, flaws. The world tries to tell us to be perfect. We compare ourselves to these images that we see in social media, on magazines, on advertisements that are airbrushed that are perfected, that are edited, that are fake. We compare ourselves to these fake images and call them beautiful. The truth is though, is that physical beauty fades. What's more important than anything is knowing and understanding the truth about what God says about our beauty. God created man in his own image. He's made everything beautiful. You are fearfully and wonderfully made. Strength and dignity are her clothing. People look at the outward, but the Lord looks at the heart. 
You are altogether beautiful, my love. There is no flaw in you. This is what real beauty is. Real beauty is your natural self. Real beauty is the way that you were created. I hope that this is able to hopefully encourage you to not find yourself in makeup or to not find yourself in fashion or anything that the world tells us that we need to have real beauty. I hope that you have a blessed day and remember that your worth is far above rubies. Bye y'all.